This type of operation is not a one man show. Okay, it's like the it's like the pharmaceutical cartel that we have in Zambia. Nobody works independently. Nobody. This guy is connected to this guy who's connected to that guy who's connected to that guy. And, 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 and there's a cartel. So here it is now. My understanding, what I'm hearing, I could be wrong, but what I'm hearing is that he's sort of hinting that if I'm going to go down, I'm not going by myself. I'm not going down alone. And, and, and let's go where the evidence takes us. Wherever the, wherever the hell that's going to be. So the point is, if you're in government, don't use your position to amass personal wealth. You're, you're, we heard you on tape saying, two million kwacha. Now, against the backdrop of the mining sector, I can tell you, two million kwacha, as much as it, it's, it sounds like a huge amount of money, and it is, but the sad reality is there's so much more that's being raped from this nation by people that we don't even know. I mean, we, this is just, Derek is but the tip of the iceberg. I mean, and they talk about 2 million like it's nothing. You know, it's, 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 it's what it is. It's the rape of a nation. That's what it is. It's, and we, we haven't seen anything yet. This is just scratching the surface. And I feel sad, honestly, really, I feel sad for, for President Hakainde Hichilema that he has to, this, this is the caliber of jokers that he has to deal with. I mean, talk about being counterproductive, okay? In the past, without mentioning names, in the past, the head of state would have been part of the deal. I mean, can we be honest about that? You know, in the previous regime, and I'm not mentioning names, such things, the head of state would have been part of the deal. But here it is now, you've got a head of state who sees this for what it is. He calls it out for what it is, blatant corruption that has no place in this administration. It's going to do nothing but hurt the people of Zambia. And you've got a president that says, well, listen, if you're not going to echo my vision, I don't need you with me. I don't want you with me. I will get rid of you and I will kick you to the curb.